Last year, back in August 2022, I invested $20 every single day inside of the stock market. That's right, no matter if the price was high or if the price was low, at the same time, every day, I invested $20 inside the stock market. That is called dollar cost averaging. And I've been dollar cost averaging inside the stock market for an entire year. Now, I know you guys are wondering, did I make money? Did I lose money? Did it go sideways? Well, in this video, you guys are going to find out. Now, you're wondering why my dollar cost averaging inside the stock market? Well, by far, it is the simplest strategy that you guys can do. All you have to do is upload your brokerage with some money, sit back and relax, and let the auto investment do all of the work for you. And statistics have shown that if you invest inside the stock market consistently at the same time every day, or at the same time every week, or at the same time every month, dollar cost averaging, you will catch some of the highs of the stocks and you will catch some of the lows of the stock. And when you're buying the lows, you're buying the dips, and that kind of averages out your price to why you're not always buying the peaks because remember when you're dealing with the stock market you always want to buy low and sell high so in this video you guys are going to find out if i made money or lost money over the last 365 days whether this strategy is something that you want to do from yourself well in fact if you guys are somebody that's just starting off inside the stock market and you're wondering how to get started well i'm going to leave two links down in the description the first one is to mumu if you sign up with mumu they have commission free investment they have the auto reinvestment apps to where you could dollar cost average as well if you deposit hundred dollars you could get up to 15 free stocks that's right, 15 free stocks, um, up to 15 free stocks if you deposit $100 into Moomoo. And I'm also going to leave a link down in the description to Weeble. If you sign up with Weeble, deposit one penny. That's right, any amount of money, if you deposit one penny inside of Weeble, you could get up to 15 free shares as well. Um, if you're just getting started, this is by far the easiest way to get started inside the stock market if you do not have a lot of money. Even if you do have a lot of money, uh, nothing beats free. So check out those two links down in the description, but enough talking, let's go ahead and dive straight into this video. Welcome back dreamers. Here we are inside of my portfolio. As you guys can see, I got a couple of auto investments on this account. I got some going into ARKK, QYLD and VLO. By far the safest one on here is VLO that tracks uh, the top 500 companies in America. And the, more, and the most risky one on here is ARKK. And then the very next one that pays the highest dividend that I've been investing $20 into every single day for the last 300 in 65 days what a little over 365 days but a little over a year guys by a couple of days is qyld which has a very high dividend yield it's a double digit dividend yield which pays me passive income every single month because this is a monthly pan dividend stock now if we click on qyld i'm going to show you guys the benefits of dollar cost averaging inside of the stock market as you guys can see i'm paying 20 dollars every single day and that that's monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday so of course saturdays and sundays are off limits and holidays when the stock market closed is off limits so it's around a hundred dollars a week inside of this particular stock now as you guys can see i first placed my order on august 8th 2022 at a price of 18 dollars and 48 cents now just imagine if i came up on five thousand dollars hey i want to invest into this um this stock that pays out these high dividends qyld i'm going to invest all five thousand dollars into qyld right now i would have bought those shares at 18 dollars and 48 cents and as you guys can see right now the current price is 17 dollars and 73 cents meaning i would have lost money if i invested everything on august 8th of 2022 but as you guys know i dollar cost average but now as you guys can see my average price right there on, on the left is 16 dollars and 93 cents while the current price is $17.73, meaning I am in profit. Now, how are you saying, how did my average price come to $16.93? That's because on some days I was buying the dips and some days I was buying the highs. So as I was buying the lows and the highs, it kind of averaged out my price, brought down my dollar cost average and put me in profit. Now we take a quick look at QYLD. Over the last year, you guys can see, I started investing on August 8th. Um, it doesn't go back, it goes back to August 15th at $18.51 and then it just plummeted plummeted it down like div high dividend stocks do it plummeted it down and a lot of investors would get scared at this point but this is my most risky um etf that i have inside of my portfolio i was prepared for this i wasn't scared of this at all when so when it took a dip down i was buying all of these lows twenty dollars there twenty dollars there so when it went all the way back down here to fifteen dollars and thirty nine cents i was buying these shares at fifteen dollars and thirty nine cents so as i did buy the highs right here i was also buying all of these lows it went up about the high right there 
1620. Bought the low right there at 1592. So on the swings up and on the swings down, I was buying the highs and lows. So if we take a look, I have 337 shares just in one year. My market value on these shares is $5,989 and my average cost is $16.96. I am up 4.53%, $259.17. So I am up 4% in a year. Not my best performing stock, but uh, just imagine I could have been down if I bought $5,000 at um, on August 8th, but now I'm up 4.5% from dollar cost averaging over time. And that's not even close on how much money I made. Remember that's $259, $260 right there. But like I said before, right now, QILD have a dividend of 8.8%. So we scroll all the way down to my history. There you guys can see all of my reincurrent buying every single day, the 11th, 10th, 9th, 8, 7, 4, 3, 2, 1. I'm buying these shares of QYLD. Now we take a look at the dividend payments. On my first dividend payment, I got paid out $3.78. I reinvested my dividends from QYLD right back into it, and I continue to buy $20 every single day. So the next month, since this is a monthly paying dividend stock, I got paid out $7. The next month after that, $13, then $17, then $22, then $26. Now that I'm getting $26 a month in dividends, from the dividends alone, I'm able to buy full shares of QYLD so I'm not even spending my own money. Now QYLD is paying me in dividends to buy shares back from their own company. So after $26, I was getting $30 a month, $35 a month, $41 a month, $44 a month, $51 a month. And now on August 1st of this month, just one year later, I'm getting $57 a month every single year in dividends from QYLD. So next month will probably be my first $60 month. And if we do the math on that, um, $60 times 12, I could be bringing in an extra $720 every single year in dividends just from QYLD from investing $20 a day. It'll be a lot more than that once I reinvest that $720 right back into QYLD to get paid more in dividends from that. So once again, guys, I'm going to be bringing you guys updates. If you guys don't want to miss updates on stocks I'm buying or stocks that I'm doing recurring investment on, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up button because that helps out this channel more than you can even imagine. Now, this is a risky play before you guys just jump in and start buying. I knew that QYLD was on the decline, that I would be probably picking up some shares on the low before it starts to pick back up. Now, I would not say if you have $5,000 to go invest into QYLD right now. I invest more into better um, less risky ETFs like VOO or SPY or QQQ. Those are less risky than a high dividend yield ETF like QYLD. In fact, I'm just doing this for an experiment for you guys on this channel. But if you are, if you are already dollar cost averaging, it's very, if you're not dollar cost averaging right now and you don't have reincurring investment set up, it's very simple. All you have to do is set up your brokerage account. You can use Robinhood, you can use Webull, link down in the description. You can use Moomoo, link down in the description. Fund your account. Once you fund your account, you set up the auto investment, and then you can just sit back and relax and check on it maybe once a month. Check on it maybe once every quarter. You do not have to check on it every single day. You can if you want to, but the only way that you could do that if you don't wanna check on it every day or every month or every quarter is to invest into good, quality stocks. I don't recommend investing to QYLD. Me personally, I would do VOO, QQQ, SPY, any of those, or maybe a, a great company that you believe in like Apple, because you can invest into individual companies as well, like Apple, Google, Microsoft, Walmart. You can pick any of those and invest a dollar every single day, $5 every single day, $2 every single day, $10 every week. It don't have to be $20 every single day like I'm doing. You can pick whatever money that you want, even a dollar, pick 10 different stocks, a dollar a day into 10 different stocks, that's $10 a day. And you could grow your portfolio that way without having worrying about checking the market, checking the price, checking in and do all this. This is the most hands-off way that you guys could do as long as you're picking high quality stocks and not just picking any random stock out there that you don't even know about. So make sure that you do your own research. Guys, if you're already doing dollar cost averaging, if you're already reinvesting your dividends, let me know what company you're using down below and how long have you been reinvesting inside of this stock? Do you do it every single day for the last month? Do you do it every single week for the last year? Let me know what company it is, 
how often you invest into it and how long you've been doing it and what is the outcome. I can't wait to see what you guys write down in the comment section because I already know that you guys are, <laughs> you guys been investing a lot longer than me. This is just a year example. Some of you guys have been consistently investing into the stock market for the last 10 years. And I can't wait to see what you guys write down in the comment section to put me on even more game. But if you guys do want to find out what individual stocks I'm buying um, every single week and my option plays, I do have a link down in the pinned comment section. That'll take you to my patreon the patreon to take you to my discord inside the discord i post my options in there i post my what uh stocks i buy in there and we also have pro day traders that we have that post their option trades in there every single day so if you want to be a part of a great community that want to be financially free just like you make sure that you click that link down in the pinned comment section take you to my patreon that takes you to my discord and we just also added another pro day trader in there so now we have three pro day traders in there plus me that post their option trades in there every single day or every single week um, we just added Mr. M. He has an 80 percent win rate when it comes to option trading so if you guys want to check out uh the newly added professional trader that link is going to be down in the pin comment section but yeah guys that's it make sure that you check out the links down in the description sign up do not miss out on free stocks i promise you guys you don't want to miss out on free money and this is some of the best uh, promotion that these companies have been running in quite a while so if you don't want to miss out on some free stocks make sure that you click those links down in the comment section and while you're down there go ahead and hit the thumbs up button and hit that subscribe button because that helps out this channel more than you guys can even imagine. But other than that, I'm Zeke. Bring you. Thank. But other than that, I'm Zeke. Bring you the Dream Green Show, and I'm out. Peace.